Hi, and welcome back to Kirby's Kitchen. I'm your host, Grace. Today we are making a chocolate Dutch baby pancake. Here's what you're gonna need. For chocolate Dutch baby pancakes, you're gonna need three large eggs, a third of a cup of all-purpose flour, a quarter of a cup of sugar, three tablespoons of unsweetened cocoa powder, three quarters of a teaspoon of culture salt, a half a cup of cool milk. Okay, so the first step is to whisk your three eggs all together. Okay, and then you're gonna add your flour, your sugar, your unsweetened cocoa powder, and the salt. And you're gonna whisk all this together until it's nice and incorporated. And now you're gonna add the milk. And whisk until it looks almost like a chocolate milk. Okay, that looks pretty good. So now you're gonna cover the batter and you're gonna let this rest for 15 minutes. And while that's happening, you're gonna preheat your oven to 425 and you're gonna place your cast iron pan into the oven so that it gets nice and hot. Okay, so now that the oven is preheated and the pan's out of the oven, it is blazing hot so I would not touch it. And now I'm gonna add the one tablespoon of butter into the pan and I'm gonna swirl it so that it coats the pan nice and evenly. I'm gonna give that a minute to melt the rest of the way and while that's melting I'm gonna give the batter a super quick stir to let all the air bubbles that came to the top while it was while it was resting go back down to the bottom. I'm gonna get that on the table, that is fine. I'm gonna give this one final swirl. And now I'm gonna pour the batter directly into the center of the pan. It's gonna look like the butter is all over the batter and that is completely how it's supposed to look. Now I'm going to put the pan back into the oven. It's okay if you have a pan underneath so then it catches any drippings. Now you're going to put the batter with the butter back into the oven and bake it for 10 to 12 minutes. During this, do not open the oven and peek because you will not get a puffy pancake you will get a flat pancake. I'll see you in 10 minutes. Okay, so our timer just went off and it's been 10 minutes. Now, I'm going to take it out of the oven, ever so carefully. Now that looks really, really good. So now I'm gonna let it cool down for a few minutes, but it's it's normal for it to deflate a little bit as it is cooling down. But then I'm gonna add the topping because it's gonna make it over the top delicious. Okay, now that it's cooled down, it has ours has shrunk a little bit. And I cut a piece from the pan and I put it on a plate. And now I'm gonna add those delicious toppings. First up is a big dollop of some homemade hand whipped whipped cream, which is much better than the canned stuff that you get at the grocery store. And then, in this container, I have some powdered sugar, which I'm going to put all over there. Now I'm going to, to cut a slice 
with a little bit of everything, and I'm gonna eat it. This is so good. Very chocolatey, very whipped creamy. The perfect dessert. See you next time.